Now open page 42. Now you can see that there are many 2D examples, such as triangle, this one is a triangle, a square, which one is this shape, which one is this, a pentagon, one, two, three, four, five, six, which one is this, which one is this, a hexagon, good job. Now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Which one is this? An octagon. Good job. Now, those 2D shapes that have five or more sides, which one of these have five or more sides, you write their names here. For example, pentagon. Sorry. Pentagon. Here. But those who, not, who do not have five or more sides, who have less than five sides, for example, a square, you write them like this, in here. Do this for the triangle, square, pentagon, hexagon, and octagon, and separate them. Which one of them have five or more sides? Which one of them does not have five sides? After finishing this, these are the correct answers. You can pause and double check your answers. We'll go to the next page, page 43. It asks you to... Wait... Color the rectangles. How many rectangles can you find? You can color these rectangles any color that you like. Okay? And tell me how many rectangles do you see? Alright? After that, how many different ways you can turn the triangle so that it looks like a, a very it looks like different every time, sorry. How many times can you turn this triangle so it looks different every time? For example, we can do a triangle like this. And it's different. We can do a triangle like this. And it's different. And we can do it like this. Oh, sorry. And you can do it like this, and it's also different. Do your combinations and do as many as you like. Show me different ways of this triangle can be turned. After that, go to the page 44. Can you turn a circle so that it looks like different? We have a circle here. And just another circle. We have a circle here. Can we make different ways so that the circle do not look like each other? No. But tell me why. This is an investigation section. Let's investigate. Work with your a partner or on your own to find an answer for this one. Use up to 10 squares to make a different symmetrical shape. Always place the shapes edge to edge. Draw two different designs. Use the shape and color to show the symmetry. You can design anything that you like, like this, like this, like this, but all the edges must be Together and they all have the same size. Sorry, they do not have the same size. Create some shapes for me and show to me how many of them have you used and what did you create. Okay? But there must no there must not be any gaps. 
like this one. This one is a correct one, and this is wrong. Draw anything that you like. Now we go to the last page of our unit 2, page 45. Look at this. Color the shapes with, a, with more than four sides. Any shape that have four sides, you cannot color them, but more than four, okay? You color those shapes that have more than four sides. For example, pentagon have five sides, hexagon have six sides, octagon have eight sides. You color them, all right? You do not color the other. Now, so these shapes, you can draw the shape or write their name in the sorting circle. Has four vertices or fewer. Which one of these have four vertices or fewer? Circle. Triangle. And rectangle. Or you can draw the shapes. Circle. Rectangle. And, oh, triangle, sorry, and rectangle. And now you can draw or name these ones here. Do this part and now go to the last question, which is question 11. Work with a partner and take turns. Describe 2D shape. Do not say the name of the shape. Ask your partner to guess what it is. For example, I am thinking of a 2D shape that have zero sides. What is this 2D shape? So the, the 2D shape with zero sides is a circle. Now we have, look at what I can do section. Read these and ask, answer honestly. Can you do this or you cannot do, the, you cannot do this? After finishing this section, go to do section 2.2 on your workbook. After finishing your workbook, you are all finished and ready. Hope you, uh, hope you guys best of luck and I hope you all have a great time and I wish that this video made things easier and more clear for you. And until the next video, bye bye.